Man, yeah. Go. When I met Asha, uh, she said her dream was to live in a yurt and uh, in the mountains of North Carolina. And I said, well, that's pretty convenient because that's all I have. <laughs> it's a yurt in the mountains of North Carolina on some land. Why don't you come live with me? So we had, we had the idea of community and we didn't really have a good idea of what that looked like. We never charged rent. We didn't want this place to be about money or anything. There's lots of things about this kind of life that some people would call squatting, right? Um, but I think it's very elegant and simple. Doesn't cost a lot of money. That's part of why we're moving because we don't want to pay our taxes to the American government that is not respecting the earth or the people. Or choices, um, you know, that may benefit them. And we don't want to go to jail and so we'd rather give another try somewhere else. <laughs> I just at the end of the at the end of the day, we're we're living just like most Americans. Though it, it it may seem a little different, and I've had people tell me that you guys are living, you know, this is crazy how you live, and it's it's really not much different. Mm -hmm.